Hey guys, welcome to the treehouse. And this is Backyard Time. But I'm boom! What's up guys? Today we have a crazy experiment. Now as you guys remember, we did a video, our first video actually, on an experiment called Elephant Toothpaste. Now what we do on Backyard Science is we take everything to the extreme. So we're gonna be making a giant elephant toothpaste experiment for our part two of a hundred subscriber video. Woo! It's gonna be blowing up, it's gonna get lit. So this experiment is gonna make an awesome huge tower of foam and this is gonna be a really cool experiment. So let's get into this video. Okay, now the reason in our first video it didn't go so high and it was kind of lame, 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 is because that was 3% hydrogen peroxide. But what we have today is 30%. Now this is very dangerous. It can bleach your hands, that's a bad thing. That's why we brought <laughs> rubber ducky gloves. Oh frick. Whoopsie <laughs> daisy. We brought rubber gloves just in case we don't want to bleach any of our hands. And we got potassium, yeah, potassium permanganate. All these weird chemicals have weird names. It's like the longer the name is, the more dangerous. Um, this is a high oxidizer, if I remember correctly. And this will make, or it'll um, influence the foam. <laughs> and so, we also have yeah. like spoon. Yeah, we use spoon. spoon. <laughs> we also have a beaker and some dish soap. All right, let's get into this video. Yay! Have our gloves out. All right, so we're gonna put on our gloves because this can stain your hands. Since now we have our gloves on, um, we can get into the experiment right away. All right, so we're gonna take our beaker here and you're gonna fill this up if you don't have a like measured thing. Uh, 75 me millimeters, I think. Oh, uh, liters. Yeah, liters. Yeah. Once you've got that. You are going to take your dish soap and you are going to pour that in. Put in about like three seconds, probably. One, two, three. That should be good. Okay, yeah. close that up and then we mix it. Just to show how like powerful the hydrogen peroxide is, you can see that our spoon is like stainless steel now, and it's super silver polished. This used to be like black with dirt. Now it's like polished to like, it looks like stainless steel. It's like disgusting gray. All right guys, now we are going to take our hydrogen peroxide mixture and we are going to put this into our beaker. This noise is amazing. So Bexton was the pouring here because Ben spilled Prussian blue on his shoes and table. Now we're gonna get a spoonful of this potassium magnite. Potassium permanganate. Yeah. Permanganate. Permanganate. Per I thought it was a liquid. Ah! Now we're gonna pour it in. Three, one, two. Fast. Whoa, it's smoking. Whoa. 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 Hold on, wait for it to see in. Yeah, it's gotta hit the bottle. Oh yeah. No, hold on, wait for it. Dude, it's working! Okay, it looks like it looks like a long marshmallow. It looks like we poured it a little too slowly, so we're probably gonna have to do a retry. But this is really cool because it's like puffy and it's got like little like it does look like a just like a big long s'more. Oh, oh there it goes. There we go. I think it had to kick in. Dude, there it smoking. goes. It's going now. Oh, it's dude, it's smoking. It's smoking. Oh, oh. dude. Jeez, man. It's like doing a circle. Look at that. Dude, it's pink. It's gonna cover up the whole bottle. It is so good. Oh my god, it's hot. All right, so we our first uh, attempt didn't work out so well. It was a little delayed because Ben poured it too slow. <laughs> so this time we put in the potassium permanganate in first, so that way it can touch it all over. <laughs> okay, it worked. It worked. <laughs> Yo, it started so uh, bad! Yo, it started oh, so hard! Yeah. Dude, it's snowing! <laughs> what the heck? Guys, the real thing is, 
This is warm. Oh, it is? Uh, oh, it's kind of cold. Dude. Oh my gosh, that feels so oh. good right now. Oh my gosh. It feels so good. It's like marshmallow substance. It's so weird. Look at it. Dude, it's like it feels bouncy. so good. Ugh. Oh my gosh, y'all. This thing is huge compared to Dude, our first one. Move it into the Do you first remember our ah, first one? Where's the beaker? <laughs> I don't know where the beaker is. Dude, my is. hands are like so. I think the beaker is lost somewhere. <laughs> Found the beaker. Yeah. I found the beaker! There it is! Choo choo! Oh my oh gosh, guys, it's about to fall off the table. There's so much of it. So good. Dude, it's falling off already. Oh my gosh, it's all over my black I'm scared. jacket. I'm scared it's gonna, gonna take off white. my gloves and my hands gonna be completely white. I know. Alright guys, that experiment was crazy. It was so much fun. It was just like this beaker, and then we poured it in, and then it just like exploded with marshmallows. I just wanted to like take it all and then eat it. So, this was very, be uh, very better. This was so much better than our first attempt. It was such, so much bigger too. 10 yeah. times the percentage of hydrogen peroxide. And then once again, like and subscribe, and we can't thank you enough for 100 subscribers. See you next time on Backyard, Backyard Science. Science. Yes. Woo!